so this is very sweet. This is very you, but I don't think that it would be a good idea. Look, I, I know we're on a timeout right now, and, and but tomorrow's our anniversary, and I just can't bear the thought of spending it without you. I would love to. I really would. You have no idea how much, but I, uh, I'm worried that it would be unfair. Because no matter how great dinner would be, I would still need our timeout. No, no, I know. I'm not trying to put an end to the timeout. I'm just saying, what if we could... Have a timeout from our timeout? Exactly. So what do you think? I would love to have dinner with you tomorrow. Got a sec. Hmm. Found something odd in our victim's financials. What? Direct deposits from a shell corp. There's a bunch of them. Five grand each. The last deposit was made three days ago. That's the same day that Anton said he and Scott worked their bit on that woman in the bar. You know what? Most of these payments line up with when Anton said Scott hired him. Sounds like Scott wasn't picking up on married women for fun. Sounds like he was getting paid for it, but why? Don't know. I haven't found much on the Shell Corp. But they do list an address, a pricey apartment uptown. And when I called the building manager, he said Scott rented it a year ago. Okay, so our victim is an out-of-work actor getting mystery money from a mystery corporation, and now there's a mystery apartment. It's a lot of mysteries. What the hell was this guy into? Whatever it was, it might have gotten him killed.